Welcome everyone, it's Kevin LaRocca here with Binary Pro Strategies. Today we're going to do a recap of all the trades I made in chat. It is Monday, March 18th, and it is 2019. And uh, the one thing I wanted to mention, something that kind of came up today, is uh, volatility. Now, one of the things you're going to find when you're trading uh, these binaries is that when you have higher volatility, okay, in other words, we have uh, a lot more traders in the market, have a lot more movement in the market, uh, what you're going to find, you're going to find that you're going to get higher premiums. So you're going to be able to, when you put on a trade, you're going to be able to, instead of maybe selling it at, uh, you know, 20, 30 bucks, you may get 40, you may get 52. But when the volatility goes down, you have to be willing to take less. So if you're trading, let's say that uh, volatility is, you're trading at night and the volatility is very quiet you're probably not going to get real good premium. You're going to have to be able to take smaller premiums. The only way you can uh, make up for that is to do some size. And you'll see I do a lot of adjustments on my size. Uh, if I feel I have a really strong trade and uh, it looks like I'm going to get some decent premium, then I'll go ahead and I'll put on, you know, more than a one lock. Um, a good ratio, people ask, what's a good ratio? Depending on the size of the account, a 1-3 ratio is good. As your account builds, you can do a 1-5 one, a one five or a 1-10. That means you're trading basically just onesies. And then when you see a really strong trade, you come in and maybe do a 3-lot. And then you go back down the ones again, come back in and hit it with a 3-lot. And that's going to come from experience. You're going to know when you have a really good setup. When you watch uh, my charts enough and you understand my patterns, you're going to know what a really good trade is and one that's kind of marginal. And when you get those kind of trades, you come in, you hit it with size. So anyway, overall, um, Marco's kind of choppy this morning. Uh, I had initial troubles with my uh, Nadex platform. That straightened out. Um, got chopped up a little bit in the morning. And then it started smoothing out. And I had some really nice trades. I was just doing, you can see I did a lot of onesies in here. And then at the end of the day, I came in on the Canadian, did a five lot. Took a hit on that, but then I came back and I did a 10 lot on that and uh, ended up making most of that back. Ended up uh, still losing about $100 on those two trades, but nonetheless, uh, still 709.25 is, is, I consider that a very good day. Uh, and like I said, we're moving into starting to get into April and May, and uh, those are usually really good months. So uh, I do look forward to seeing some really good volatility. Uh, the night trading has been. Um, kind of iffy in the sense that I haven't seen a whole lot of really good volume out there right now. So uh, once again, if you're trading at night, still good trading opportunities. Uh, you'll just kind of probably have to take a little bit less premium and that's okay. So that's just the, that's just the way it is. You, either you don't trade or you be willing to take a little bit less. Yeah, you're taking less, you're risking more. So that's why you really want to wait for those really good trades. Uh, if volatility drops down, just wait for the really strong trades and uh, trade those and then come in every once in a while and put on some size and that's how you're going to get your account growing at night as well if the volatility drops out there are nights when the volatility is just just as good as it is in the day if not better anyway that's it i'll be back tomorrow for tuesday for my next uh recap if you'd like to learn more about my uh my services you can go to binaryprostrategies.com i do offer a, a free fundamental video if you'd like to learn a little bit more about uh, one of my two strategies, which is a core strategy, uh, which I use a lot. Um, and by doing, give me your email address and uh, giving me your first name. Uh, there's a little pull down that comes down. Uh, then what we'll do, as soon as you give me that, then what happens is automatically sends you to a link where you can go ahead and watch that uh, fundamental video. Uh, also, if you have any questions, my phone number's there. My, uh, you can always shoot me an email if you like to do it that way, and I'll be glad to answer your questions. Anyway, that's it. If you like these videos, please give me a thumbs up. Please click the little notification icon. You'll be sure to get an update on any new videos that I have coming out. And that's it. Till tomorrow, y'all take care. Thanks.